Hi, my name is Max, welcome to my economic channel, Max Economics. Ceteris Paribus. What exactly does Ceteris Paribus mean? You have probably met this expression in your economics textbooks, and if nobody explained it, you learn to ignore it. The expression is Latin, it translates by other things being equal, and it is used especially in the neoclassical models. Let's take for example a graphic representation of a market. We have the price variable on the y-axis, the quantity variable on the x-axis, and from these two data, we extract the curves of demand and supply. We can see that as price decreases the demanded quantity increases and the supplied one decreases. To be able to show how markets work they assume a ceteris paribus environment with all other things being equal, simply put that the other variables do not change in the timeline of the model. In conclusion, ceteris paribus is used to note that the other variables on the market, that are not even mentioned in the model, do not change. The model implies a static image of a market in which the only variables that experience changes are the analyzed ones. That's about it for today. Thank you for your patience.